Welcome. In this chapter 12, we're going to talk about chromatic aberration. So go ahead and select this chromatic aberration, right click, and we're going to open the editor as we've done before. I want to show you where chromatic aberration is in the workflow. It's all the way down here, number 12. And the reason it's down here because it's an 8 bit mode. And I asked that in this workflow that I created, I tried to get you in 16 bit as far as possible. Okay, so this is why it's so far down in the steps. We'll go ahead and select the tab here. Now, what is chromatic aberration? This is caused by the camera lens not focusing different wavelengths of light onto the exact same focal plane. It's visible as color fringing around contrasty edges, and it occurs more frequently around the edges of the image frame and wide angle shots. So let me show you here. Um, as you can see, it's layer one, so you know that this is an 8 bit, as also shown here. Okay, so what I do is I, well, let me show you first. My bad. So let me do, zoom 100% here. Double click the zoom tool. As you can see here, press the space bar so it changes in the hand so I can move it around. See the little purplish blue cyan kind of look here? This is um, chromatic aberration. You can see on this side, oof, horrible. So, how do we fix this? My simplest way to fix it, believe it or not, go to the adjustments, which only work in 8 bit mode. Select Hue Saturation, which will open up the Adjustments panel. I'll click on the Masters, and I usually click Cyan or something color is close to it, which will open up these eyedroppers down here. I'll click this eyedropper, and then I'll let me zoom in just a little bit more, make sure I get it. Okay. And I'll select that color, and then I'll take the saturation, and I'll move it down. Now let me click Fit and View. And see how well that worked. Okay, let me zoom in so I can see how well that worked. In order to see that, which great about adjustment layers is they're non-destructive, and I can just click the eyeball, the visibility, and see the before, after, before, after. So as you can see, chromatic aberration is easy to fix.